All right, so if you here's a look at one of your uh, stubby slalom runs. Some good turns in there. Let's go check it out. A little slower. You know, I really like this one. You know, you, you intersected rise line, that imaginary line drawn up the hill from the pole, right, right here, with your skis pointing out and away. You have some space above the gate where you intersect rise line so you can bring some turn shape back. Right. That's a good looking turn. Finished turn with direction, but a very slow pole plant. You got it done here, but it needs to be, as we talk, shin and plant. It needs to be right now because your, your transition is a little slow because you eventually pole plant here and now you're going to get ready for the next turn and we're late and therefore you're wide right number two what's up with your pole straps i mean we keep asking you but um you know i think you got to cut them off if you're not going to use them just can't have them dangling around all the time um i don't now, obviously, you, you were a little late here because, uh, you know, slow transition, slow pole plant, pole plant too late, not ready, and then, I don't know, kind of leaned in. So, you know, got to be on the outside ski. I can't understand your outside hand. looks like, uh, I don't know, you can't pole plant with the pole, in, you know, pulling down the hill. I'm quite sure how you did that. Unusual, but okay. But you know, again, late pole plant. Although even though a low pole, late pole plant or no pole plant, it was a pretty good turn because you gave yourself space. You can see, you know, the the, the stubby there. You intersect rise line again, where the skis pointing out of the way, and you have adequate we call elevation or space above the gate. A nice looking turn, you roll them up, pretty level, right on it. Again, late or no pole plant, you touched it there. And we had a little terrain to deal with here. But because of not being ready, not having a quick transition, again, we're gonna be wide of this one. Good looking turn, but wide. You know, a forward pole plant through the transition would help you get recentered, rebalanced, and move forward through here. Good position there. You got pushed back a little bit. And the terrain was a little funky, I know. And no, no pole plant. Hand way behind you, so you can see the result. Just chucking them sideways. Undergate here should have, you know, saved you a bit. And, you know, nice looking turn there. But then here, just did not give yourself that elevation. Now you're going to come at it way too straight. Not intersecting rise line with any, any, you know, any space above. Just going straight at it and therefore, boom, chuck them sideways. Kill your speed on the flat. So, you know, good looking turn. So, uh, a few things. To review, put your pole straps on or cut them off. Um, number two, you gotta have a quicker pole plant and consistently in a forward pole plant. You gotta move forward in that transition, right? We gotta be outside ski to outside ski.